Hey, hi everyone. Good morning. Welcome back to Gopal Self Force. Uh, today we are going to complete uh, PD1 maintenance for winter 2025. So we have like at least like one week back. So we need to complete the these two exams for maintenance for active uh, PD1 certification on your account. Okay, so let's uh, go to the topic. So so this is the PD1 maintenance exam. So I'm going to ping this uh, details to the description link so you can access there and uh, let's try. So I already went this uh, information on the PD1 certification itself. Means like uh, I'm going to read all the things earlier. So if you want, like you can go through this all the information which have provided the sales force. So you can read these all the things. Okay, so directly I'm going to complete my uh, quiz here. So we'll go there. Okay, so here is the quiz questions. So what is the developer uh, do using the free event monitoring? So I will go to the P and C. So why because I, I already went these all the information. So I'm going to put directly to the answers. If you want to read, like you can read all the questions. So final one. So it should be yeah. okay. Fine. So now I'm going to check. Yeah. So now like in we have completed like a quiz. Okay. So now we are going to take this one second one. Okay. So open this one. Okay. So here, like we need to create one OPEX class and one test class, and we need to run that. So for that, like we need to create one uh, trailer. Okay, so we need to create one uh, free trailer here, and then we have to launch. So I already launched here, like I went to this one. Okay, so what we need to do? So first we'll go to the next model. This is done, right? So now we open this one. So they're asking to create uh, one Apex class and test class with the name of my trouble. And also we have test list name couple like uh, my trouble test. Okay. So here they're asking a couple of like we need to pass and constructor parameters and installation. So I have already created what these uh, test classes and main class for this. So I'm going to provide this all the coding part into the description section so you can access the range easily. So let's say I'm going to create one Apex class first. For creating that, so I'm going to go with like a developer console. So here I'm going to create one new Apex class. So Apex class name should be my iterable and OK. Now I'm going to copy paste these other things. I'm going to share this all the information to with you, okay? And uh, we need to create one test class as well. So now I'm going to create one test class also with the name of uh, my iterable test, okay? Bex class and each test. And I'm going to paste this all the information which I have. So I'm going to share with you all the information. Let's copy this. Copy. Now go there and paste it here. Okay. So just click save. Then I'm going to save the suffix class and this test class as well. Okay. So now it's done. So now we need to check with the labs. Why? Because uh, here is the mention. 
So in here they mention like you know to stick with the like debug class, it like hello world. So in Apex class itself, like we created that debug class itself, like hello world. Okay, so let's say uh test so run on. So here should be like uh, successful all things, okay. So now we can see here debug only. So now we can say like hello world. Okay. So this is the what this what like they are expecting to complete that. Okay. So now I am going to run this finally as a run test. So this is also working fine. Let's see, we can see here like a test should be covered. And the coverage should be this Apex class. We can see here like hundred percent. Okay, so that hundred percent class has been covered. Okay, so now I'm going to verify this challenge. Now we'll see. So this is the way. Like we need to complete all first and second, which our uh, first sales force. Uh, PD1 certification winter 2025. Okay. So I'm going to share this all the information into the like a comment section. So you people can access easily there and we can complete uh, your PD1 certification maintenance winter 2025. 25. Okay. If you have any questions, like uh, I'm, I'm going to provide my number also in comment section. So you can reach out, like you people can reach out any questions to directly. You can ping me on WhatsApp as well for more information. Okay. Uh, thank you for watching this video. And please subscribe my channel and share with your friends and colleagues and like the video. Thank you. Thank you all.